what I think is happening that the cells are not sewn right to the trailing edge. There's about, you know, there's about what, maybe you know, four centimeter gap at the trailing edge. I imagine that's let the airflow. And because it's not connected to the trailing edge, the pressure builds up there and it tears it from the back of the trailing edge of the kite to the leading edge, um, as you can see here. Can you see? It's from there all the way to uh, about there. That's a three meter. This 1.4 is totally devastated. It's been taped up already. Um, these kites um, are not strong enough. Uh, they're going to have problems continuously. You know, I mean, I've, I've flown fours for a long time, and I know what they can take. And um, it's pretty much the worst kite that I've ever had as far as popping cells. Which is disappointing because they're a great kite. The 1.4 is fantastic. It flies beautifully. It's a great kite. I've got a little six-year-old on it. He loves it. You know, um, but you drop it down twice on the ground, even in light conditions, and they pop. You know, so so far all this kites that are sold of this brand has popped. So um, I think to repair it at the trailing edge, saw it right to the end of the trailing edge, and I think you'll solve most of the problem. But I just think they're weak. I think you need to spend more time in stretching the fabric or the, or the stitching or something. You know, because like I said, I've got other kites there that have flown for years and they've never popped at all. And we've flown them in 25. I might teach on them, so they've dropped them in, you know, hit them to the ground fully hard at, <laughs> at 25 knots. Boom! And they come, up, they come back up again and, and not a problem. One of the brands has never broken on me. Never. You know? And, and we've hit it hard. Like, really, really hard. This is just not acceptable. So, I love the kites and I think they're great. But this problem has to be fixed. So now I'm going to spend the rest of the afternoon taping it up and so I can actually fly them. But yeah, it's a shame. See what you can do about it.